last week and I asked you if at that point the administration was satisfied that Hillary Clinton, Secretary of State, and the Foundation had complied with the Memorandum of Understanding and done everything in accordance with what the uh, White House expectations were. Mm -hmm. And you said it had. There's been another story. 1,100 donors to the Clinton Justice Sustainable Growth Initiative undisclosed. Richard Luger, who is, the President has, and I believe still does hold in high regard, said that he, looking at that, believes that this did not meet the spirit or the intent of the Memorandum of Understanding. So let me ask you again, is the administration satisfied, is the President satisfied that everything that was done met the standards of the Memorandum of Understanding and all the disclosures that should have been there were there? Uh, Major, I think what I said last week uh, is that, the, that there has been no evidence uh, produced by even uh, the Secretary's most ardent partisan critics uh, that her, the decisions that she made as Secretary of State were in any way uh, influenced uh, by uh, anything that was done at uh, the Families Foundation. Yes, as, as we can revisit, I asked you specifically about compliance that satisfied the President, and you said the compliance did satisfy the President, the President was proud of her service, and everything was done in accordance with his expectation. I but just I, ask you that question again. I, and I think, I, I think even last week I was reluctant to talk about the specific compliance because the White House is not in a position to enforce that compliance. So it is in a position to render a judgment. Uh, it's the State Department's responsibility to, uh, to enforce and verify that compliance. Uh, so that's why I've referred questions to the State Department or to the uh, to Family Foundation when it comes specifically to that aspect uh, of this question. So. Uh, what, what I can render judgment on is what I know about Secretary Clinton's service as Secretary of State. It was exemplary, uh, and the President's proud of her service. Uh, but when it comes to the specific uh, memorandum in question, uh, I'd refer you to the agency that was responsible for enforcing that memorandum. That's the State Department.